we all need that one. And the Holy Spirit helps restore the penitent to the image of God. Yeah. So we are called to love God and to love one another. Yeah. And care for environment. Yeah. Okay. That's why we are using uh, computers instead of paper. To care for environment. Though. <clears throat> Great controversy. I think we are rich here. Who is going to win the great controversy? Of course, God. Because God is very powerful. Check my test. I am supposed to keep this. Okay. If you think you are handsome and beautiful, be careful. That's what happened to Satan. Diva? Are you happy you are not handsome? Okay. If we are not handsome, we are not. Uh, we will not be tempted to be proud. But some people are proud even if they are not handsome. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So Satan became the rebel, rebel, rebel in heaven, and he tempted Adam and Eve. <clears throat> so if Satan tempts us, how do we avoid? By Quoting the Bible. If the Bible te Satan tempted Jesus, Jesus said, it is written. And so many people were thinking of evil in Genesis 6, so God decided to format the world with water. That's why we have rainbow now. It's a promise that there will never be a worldwide flood. That was in Genesis 6. And this world, do you know that we are all actors and actresses? <clears throat> and this world is a theater. And who are the viewers? The subscribers are the whole universe. <laughs> they are looking at us in CCTV. <laughs> there is a CCTV, and they are looking at all of us. Nakakahiya yung ginagawa natin dito, no? Nakikita. We are being observed by other worlds and the angels. So we are all in the middle of this great controversy <clears throat> conflict. Yeah. But God will win. And the issue of the great controversy is who will we obey? Because the Bible says, Him, how do you search in the Bible? You just type Bible. Him who we obey are servants of. You just type whatever you remember in the Bible. Oh, it says here in Romans 6, Know ye not that to whom ye yield yourselves servants to obey? His servants ye are to whom ye obey. Okay. If we follow Satan's idea, we are servants of Satan. If we follow God's idea, we are servants of God. Simple, right? And that is the great controversy. Who will we obey? Who will we believe? <clears throat> and where did sin originate? In heaven or in Garden of Eden? According to the Bible, it is Satan, Lucifer, who invented sin in heaven. And then he came down and tempted Adam and Eve. So even in heaven, sin cannot be explained. <clears throat> there is no explanation for sin. Otherwise, it will not be sin. Okay. Don't worry, even if we die, we can be resurrected. Oh, no, no, we, we are talking about Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ resurrected himself. That's why we should be sip sip to Jesus Christ, right? Because he can resurrect. He is the strongest power. God's word is very powerful, my friend. That's why I'm telling you how to... I tell you about God's word, because God's word can resurrect us. Oh, very powerful. <clears throat> when we die, if we die, no problem. Experience of salvation. Yan. Everybody needs this. You know what, class? For us Christians, whether we will backslide or not, it depends on whether we understand the Bible or not. Because Jesus said in the parable in Matthew 12, those who do not understand, the, the enemy comes, it's like the birds. The birds are I know, picking the seeds that were in the road. The, the enemy is the bird. 
the enemy will, will get them. But those who understand, they are fruitful. Yeah, they're 10 times, 30 times, 60 times. <clears throat> so the difference is, the people who, who understand, they are fruitful in their ministry. The people who don't understand, they backslide. They leave the church. They, do, they go to the world, become worldly. So the difference between those who become worldly and get lost and those who are fruitful and uh, are saved is the understanding, diba? Those who don't understand, get lost. Those who understand. That's why we have to <clears throat> help people understand. And just help and help and help. Unlimited. How are we saved? We are saved by grace.